Hey friends, today we are going to assemble the jaw mice dash cam mirror. So let's see how it's going to be look like. So let me open it up. So this is how you connect to the USB and uh, you have to press the button on the bottom and it will turn it on and there are a couple of options there let me connect it there so this is how it came out this is the back camera uh, up here i had to put it up you can see see oh where are my okay see it's up oh it's upside down okay but i have to peel off the plastic and there's a plastic up on the glass as well the mirror and this is the front camera and this is the GPS that goes on the windshield. So you have to take the peel off the plastic from here. See, it looks so nice. So it's over here. Uh, let me turn on the light. See. When you look in the mirror, you can see all the way back. It's pretty same as the regular mirror. See, this is how it looks like. So if you want to look the back, look at the back. Just press the button, and you can see. See, you can see the reverse. Oh, you can see the both. So fitting the back camera, you gotta open up the back trunk and you gotta remove this cap from here. If you have a small hole over here, you can just pass this wire through the hole. I was making a hole over here to put the older camera. So I'm taking the old one out and putting the new one. I had a hole over here already, so I'm gonna put it up here and I had to remove this old camera and I'll connect it. Hey guys, so today I have put up the camera on my Volkswagen CC Sport and here is the dash cam. Mirror. I had to put the camera right up on the windshield and one behind the number plate. And also, let me turn on the key. When you turn the key in, it starts the screen. There you go, that's the back camera. So you can change the direction too. If you wanna see the front, you can st uh, also one more thing you start recording immediately after you turn it in you can turn it off and also uh, if you wanna change the view see th so this is the back side of the car and this is the front side of the car right up here see it's so uh, it's all clear and this is also recording if you want to see split view, just press two times and you can see. And also one more thing, uh, let me start the car. Okay, see, you can see the back side with the mirror. 
if you don't want the screen on you can just turn it off and it is uh, uh, same as the regular mirror and you can turn it on and also one more thing or oh, when you change the shift when you change the shift to reverse gear it's gonna change the position if if you want to change that position you can change like this too so you can give it back up there you go it starts moving okay when you change the gear to front clarity of the camera always recording as you can see over here
so whenever you change the shift to reverse gear you will change uh, you will see the camera turns automatically to the back camera see? and also you can adjust by touching the screen and changing the view connected the back camera over here the front oh no the front camera over here the back camera on the car uh, second one this is the main power power and this is a GPS connection yeah only thing you have to take the wire to the uh, ceiling like, uh, on the top of the roof and the back camera wire goes on the top of this side and goes through the uh, mat on the corner just behind the seat and goes to the back yeah that's how it is <laughs> 